Hi, my name is Tan Hyang. You can call me TH. Today, with me, this is the new Latitude 5000 series. Let's do some open box for this new model, 5320. This is the box as usual. I think this is the commercial box, which is a uh, uh, brown color. And uh, let's open out what's inside there. When you open out, uh, first, of course, uh, you can see this is the uh, UK power cord. And uh, this is the new 65 watt uh, USB-C adapters. And uh, probably we'll do some comparison that uh, old and new, the different there. And uh, remove this uh, small little you can see the inside and uh, let's remove this uh, recyclable sponge and uh, yeah you can see these uh, new models and let's see inside there hey there's some um, let me just put aside for this we also have this uh, small little uh, user's guides and of course uh, safety and regulation information let's put aside first and this is the new one, which is the Latitude 5320. Let me just open up. Very, very new. Whoa, this is nice. So, as you see, this is a uh, silver color. And this is a uh, 5000 series uh, 5320 13 inch. Let me just open up. Wow, this is nice. Um, you can see that this uh, overall models that are very clean design and you can see this 13 inch uh, with the two side narrow borders um, and we see these uh, webcams and there's a webcam shutter as well safe shutter and uh, we also have the, the very nice keyboard I believe this will be a backlight keyboard and at the back of this uh, particular model we can see that it's very clean design the ventilation at the back and uh, we can see the uh, models are listed over here um, let me just uh, try to turn it on Let's see yep there's some power over here um, as you see that this uh, particular model actually have uh, most of the ports that required by most of the users uh, commercial users there is a uh, two uh, USB-C and then both is actually can uh, power power in and um, uh, this will be a Thunderbolt 4 and we have a full size USB and this one uh, as uh, a very SD card reader and we also have this uh, HDMI and the another USB uh, 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 port and of course uh, uh, audio jack and of course some of these uh, users may need the uh, SIM card on the uh, 4G then we have a SIM card insert over here and of course not forgetting the uh, lock as well yeah this will be our first time turn it on uh, oh yeah too bad this is not a touch screen so we have to using the mouse and uh, you know, click on it and do some setup uh, let me do a quick setup then I'll uh, just come back to you that some of these uh, uh, new features of these uh, new models. These particular models as you see that um, you can open out 180 degrees. I think it's good for sharing when you open out in the table. Um, uh, some users will prefer definitely a touch screen and uh, unfortunately for this model that I have this uh, open box is without a touch panel. Uh, we do have a touch panel upsell option. And this is a pretty light and um, a little one I put in just on the, the waiver to see that how light it is. Uh, just by the feel, it should be around 1.4, less than 1.4 kg for this 13 inch. Uh, we can see that there's a really uh, nice uh, design on the matte surface on this LCD, this is non-touch. And uh, we can see that the keyboard slightly, the layout slightly different than some of the hot keys that uh, we used to use it. Uh, they, are, they are changing some of the function key uh, towards to, um, the volume up, down and of course the mute, the, the audios and of course the backlight, the brightness and of course the toggle between the screen. So they have prioritized that um, some of this function key versus previous uh, 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 models and which will align with what we are doing day in day out that uh, uh, we're doing some uh, web, uh, web, web call on the Zoom or maybe uh, MS Teams um, the common things that we do of course is will be the uh, mute and of course the uh, buttons and of course the speaker up and down the in terms of the volume so I think this is uh, very common uh, I will say that the touchpad I love the touchpad is really big and um, uh, you can see that this overall uh, uh, product itself has uh, matte a surface but it's not the aluminium this will be the recycled material 
and which is uh, from the base and of course the cover as well. This is not aluminium, but it's a definitely uh, a nice recycled uh, material that we are using. And um, uh, I love the uh, bag that actually they have uh, learned some of the, the, the user's feedback that they put in some of the base, the rubbles to ensure that when the system plays it on the table and when it open out um, beyond a 120 degrees, then that will at least uh, uh, hold it up the, the laptops rather than let the panel or maybe the metals that touch directly on the surface that we have on the table. I think this is uh, pretty steady in the way that um, when we're using a laptop, so there's a common feedback from the users that hey, you know, I wanted to ensure that uh, you know the 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 laptop didn't close it easily, and of course the open out easily as well. I think this uh, uh, particular laptop done almost all the things that you needed. Um, uh, definitely, I love uh, and welcome a lot of the ports that are available, and this definitely helping uh, because when it comes to uh, work from home or work remotely. Uh, to bring additional dongle is, is good but sometimes you just want it to be handy and just plug in the USB so if you have to factor in the uh, USB-C so that we have a total of four ports uh, that can utilize and it's quite useful because one of it definitely uh, if you're not using the Bluetooth uh, headset you will probably using the USB so you will utilize one at least have one uh, left that for you to use I think this is pretty cool when it comes to the comparisons, uh, this 5000 series normally uh, will have uh, more ports versus the 7000 series in the latitude. So we can see that from the way that they built on the port the availability on the left and right. And of course some of the screen experience, uh, I don't know, webcams on the uh, screen resolutions in terms of the size of the LCDs, I think it's pretty decent. And we're looking at the keyboard, touchpad, everything will be quite similar from uh, 7000 series that um, I'm going to review for later on. So when we're looking at this, I think the weight, um, I, as I mentioned before, is less than 1.3 kg. Uh, the touchscreen probably slightly heavier a little bit. Uh, but looking at this one for uh, a travelers, which is uh, uh, actively carrying around this system uh, to uh, uh, multiple locations to work, uh, that's pretty useful. Uh, summarize this uh, particular uh, 5000 series, the 5320, with a, a thumbs up. Because when it comes to the weight itself, definitely is in the sweet spot, less than 1.3 or around 1.3 kg. And the size of the LCD just nice, not too small. Um, it, people at my age probably will have some challenge that working on 11 inch or maybe 12 inch. I think this 13.3 inch that helped me a lot. And plus of the resolution, Full HD or even some they want to push all the way in the uh, uh, 7000 series or 9000 series to the 4K. Uh, yes, you can, but uh, I don't think that is needed at this moment because most of the application that will be designed mostly on the Full HD. And uh, secondly, when it comes to the Dell Optimizer, which I uh, mentioned multiple times, uh, is really useful because uh, at least you don't need to like figure out, uh, uh, try to figure out how to really do a setting for the noise cancelling, how to do the setting for the uh, battery usage, how to really optimize the application. Some of you probably is very good that in the technical that you know uh, what to do some uh, fine tuning to really enhance the application or even uh, turn off certain things but not all the users know how to do so so i think this definitely helping the users to have a better experience when they're using this machine the third thing which i like is overall the build of the system uh, yes you may say that hey you know uh, latitude always using the magnesium alloy uh, uh, aluminium or even the carbon fibers on some of the selected uh, uh, series but for 5000 series this will be a recyclable material that we're using um, pretty decent and uh, I like the way that they uh, put in the matte surface which you don't really capture a lot of uh, uh, fingerprint and uh, most important thing is that you feel really durable and the serviceability for this uh, system is uh, pretty cool um, uh, by open uh, uh, probably like six uh, sorry eight uh, uh, screw that you can open out and service the battery memories and not forgetting of course the, the, the SSD as well so I think this is uh, pretty good as an overall system which I open box and I'm um, happy to answer any question if you leave the message uh, below in these videos um, this will be overall the open box experience for this uh, 5000 series the latest uh, 5320 latitude from Dell. Thank you.